Hello, this is Blue Joe Saunders, WBO middleweight champion of the world. Subscribe to Sport and Icons to stay in touch with all the top news. God bless you all. Abel Sanchez, who is the trainer of Triple G, Gennady Golovkin, who is the current unified champion. He holds all the titles, of course, except the WBO, which Blue Joe Saunders has. And Abel Sanchez has said that he doesn't believe that Triple G will ever become undisputed middleweight champion because Billy Joe Saunders will price himself out. And this is what Sanchez had to say. The priority is to keep Gennady busy. We know that he's never going to be unified champion. Billy Joe Saunders is never going to fight him because Saunders is looking for lottery money. He's waiting for the opportunity and Saunders doesn't want to fight him. He asked for $7 million to fight Daniel Jacobs. Imagine what he would ask for Golovkin. He will want Anthony Joshua money. So we're kind of certain that we're not going to get that belt. The belts are not as important as what's in Gennady's best of interest. But he's not bummed out. So that's Sanchez's statement. Um, I disagree. To be honest, um, I do. Um, of course, Billy Joe will want a lot of money. But likewise, Triple G will also want a lot of money. Now, what would be more profile? Would it be better to have the fight in the States or would it be better to have it in the UK? Obviously with the UK, Frank Warren, Billy Joe Saunders promoter has BT Sport now and the function to do pay-per-view now as well. So they can always generate the money if necessary. So they could make Triple G an offer if they like. Um, but so he says that he wants 7 million to fight Daniel Jacobs. Um, that does seem like a lot of money to be honest. But how does he know that? How, do, how would he know that? Because... Jacobs is not a fighter of Tom Loeffler. Um, he's part of the match room, Eddie Hearn's stable. So how would he even know that? But of course, you have to look at just before Triple G signed up to originally face Canelo for the first time around, or the only time around, I, I suppose, a contract was sent to Billy Joe Saunders from Triple G. And Billy Joe Saunders did actually sign it. So whatever it was in that, in that deal, it was perfectly fine for Billy Joe Saunders. They sent it back to Triple G, and then Triple G opted to fight for Canelo, which obviously was for money and for the fact that Canelo is the lineal champion, of course, at middleweight. So I don't blame Triple G for taking that route at all, but to say that Billy Joe Saunders will price himself out, I mean, listen, maybe Triple G's going to price himself out. Maybe he wants too much money because now he's used to fighting for big money. Well, I say used to it, he got huge money to fight Canelo. So if he wants undisputed, maybe he's thinking he should get around about the same for Billy Joe Saunders. Don't know. I mean, it's hard to say. Of course, this is all one side of the story. Uh, for me, um, Billy Joe, he does want to fight Triple G. And I believe Triple G does want to fight Billy Joe. But if you put the option of a Canelo rematch there or Billy Joe Saunders, even for the same money, I think Triple G would choose Canelo. That's just my honest opinion. I really do. But I don't know. Time will tell, I suppose. Um, now, of course, you could also argue that Billy Joe, he had the opportunity to fight uh, Triple G. Well, I say had the opportunity when there was originally talks of it. And he said that he wasn't ready for Triple G at one point. But, of course, things have now changed. And Billy Joe Saunders has said that he wants Triple G now. And he did actually sign a contract to fight Triple G over in Kazakhstan. So... For me, I don't think that Abel Sanchez is being entirely truthful on this one. Or maybe he is, I don't know. I mean, obviously, I don't know what kind of money Billy Joe's after. We do know Billy Joe has said on multiple occasions now that he's got enough money now to retire if he, if he really wants to. But his goal now is to become undisputed. So we'll have to really wait and see what's going to happen with that one. But uh, listen, if you don't try, you don't get, right? So him just guessing what Billy Joe wants is not good enough. If you want Billy Joe Saunders, then approach him. If Billy Joe Saunders wants Triple G, then approach him, you know, and then see what, see what is, you know. The guesswork from Abel Sanchez is no good. He doesn't know what Billy Joe's going to ask for. Billy Joe doesn't know what Triple G's going to ask for, but we'll have to wait and see, I suppose. So drop your thoughts below. Do you believe that Abel Sanchez is right, that Billy Joe Saunders will price himself out because he doesn't really want the fight? Or is Abel Sanchez just making up stories because maybe triple g doesn't really want billy joe saunders anyway drop your thoughts below click that thumbs up subscribe catch your next video